the fuck? Okay. All right. That uh, was a message. Uh, I just now need to know if we are alive. Okay. Uh, I have one question. If I have the uh, physical dice, because I'm. If you have what? I'm rich and British. Yes. Uh, can I roll no. outside of the board? Because uh, yes, if it's you, simpler. If, yes, if you find it more simple, then you most certainly can. But uh, pl please stop changing your nickname because then I have to change the windows. Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay, uh, I'm going to revert to that. No, no, okay. No, no, I'm going no, to... no, no. That, that's good. That's good. Okay. But uh, stop. 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 Uh, I have a proposition. Put numbers before the nick. So if something happens, it will not disturb the channel. Yeah, so I, I will show you how to do it. How I do it. Uh... So I will be number one because reasons. I'll be number four. And I'm gonna check out the how do I edit my nickname. Okay. Uh added the profile server. Yep. The server profile. Yeah, but maybe our GMs doesn't. So, my coffee? Yes. I'm, a, I'm a morning person. I don't, don't do anything. I just have my hands here. <laughs> you can see yeah. them. It's not on the keyboard. So I just don't do anything. <laughs> Uh, GM, so do we apply numbers to our to our nicknames so it's simpler for, to you, or I don't know? Uh, yes, at this point we are in uh, what we would call the British Chaosium, so uh, yes. Okay, so uh, Sarah, Cornelia, so um, you will go... So you go on the options and the parameters, okay. Uh, no, well, actually, no, you, you right-click on your on you. Uh, profile. Oh shit! Wait, no. Yes. Sorry. Server profile and then which number? Yeah, yeah. And you put one number, so I guess you will be number two, and then you put a point, and then you have your name. Like this? <laughs> yes, like this. And so Cornelia mm -hmm. will get. I guess we'll do the same. And that's it. Good. So, it's... no order. Mm -hmm. Yes, British government. <laughs> we establish dominance. We are number one. <clears throat> uh, do we have a link? A link what? to the stream. A what? Uh, a link. A what? A what? <laughs> Are you making fun of my British accent? I will you never do that, sir. I won't I dare. Will never. We do have a link. But if you want, I can suck your dick. Oh, no, no, Nani? No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, <she's laughs> And it's yeah. on. Yeah. Hello, hello! Greetings! Okay, hey. but, uh, God damn it. I do not have your... Uh, your camera's picture. I need to be reloaded. Worst case scenario, we don't. That's it. Yes. Well, it is impromptu. It, it all makes sense. It is extremely British after all. Yeah, I guess. Okay. You, you, you said chaos, chaos and chew, dude. Yes. Uh, I will 
it just me? Okay. <laughs> Not this one. Oh yeah, yeah. It is what it is. At the end of the day, all that matters is that we all will have a lot of fun. Entropy is the natural order of things. Yeah, exactly. Okay, but uh, then without further ado, uh, let's say hello to everyone who is watching us from the great and mighty channel on the Twitch that is being led by Garycon. Hello, everyone. Hi there. Hello. 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 Yes, uh, we are a, a team of a Dragon Legion who have come to this incredible uh, place to stream a game of Hunter the Reckoning for you. Um, Fifth we... edition. Exactly. And uh, we are here gathered in a truly international uh, team as we all come to you from Europe, the great continent just across the pond, uh, where we have a team made out of people who are from France, from Germany, from Poland, and from all over Europe. We would also have more people, but decided after all that smaller number is better because it is always important to dose uh, things in little doses. Uh, but yes, uh, other than that, uh, I would like to use this opportunity to say a few words about the organization uh, that made this uh, stream possible, uh, which is a Dragon Legion, uh, which is a, a European base, but international in uh, any other sense. Uh, association of role players, uh, storytellers and uh, creators on all paths of life who like to make uh, fantasti fantastical stories uh, that they can then share to teach people about the wonders of our world. Uh, it is a very noble goal and we all hope to uh, bring the fun uh, to uh, people who are maybe yet not initiated in the uh, secrets of the craft that we could maybe even call uh, role-playing games uh, but we all hope that uh, it will be something for you to enjoy uh, further down the line and now I will go uh, to my noble guests who decided uh, so willingly to come and join and play the game with me as I will be their storyteller during this wonderful game and without further ado let me uh, go to my first guest who is uh, Urbahir Amonra please tell us uh, hello hello uh, my name is Raphael in real life uh, I have a firm that uh, deal with RPGs. I'm a, a hired GM now, full time. I'm really good. I'm really glad to be here. I will be playing an Egyptian British uh, gentleman in his 40s, probably. Yes. Uh, I would love to have fun with that. Thank you. Uh, going further, let's go to Sarah. Hey, uh, I'm Emily Sarah. I'm, yeah, work in Germany as an uh, eSport moderator and actor for about five years or something like now. And today we'll play an Alice phone for you, which is a young girl from an old slubby town, which is kind of boring. So we're going to the big city. And in the big city, we see big adventure with a big ride and just look. Travel a bit and going for hunts. Thank you. Uh, let's go to our next player, who is Mercrow. So, yeah, uh, I don't know what I should say, so I'm just going to introduce my character because I'm a very boring person with very boring life. So, like, in contrary to my character, which is Cornelia, <laughs> 
uh, like mm, the the main thing that she wants in life is money, money and more money. I just want all the shiny stuff, and you're gonna give me the shiny stuff, I guess. So that's it. And we will finish off the round of introductions with Rufus. Hi there. So I'm now not a professional, but uh, I've been playing for quite some time. And uh, well, I've been invited here on quite on an, I, I would say, impromptu basis. But So I'm really glad to be here. First time playing Hunter and World of Darkness mechanics. Never played before. And I'm going to be playing the Viscount Charles Bradley, a nosy brat who has a taste for investigating the occult, and who, well, who, who is who is well mannered enough that he will never tell you you're an idiot. He will just heavily imply it. This is perfect. Uh, yes. Uh, thank you all. My noble and fantastical guests <clears throat> uh, for introducing yourself. I myself and Dominic and uh, I have been involved in the uh, greater world of darkness for about seven years now, most likely. And uh, aside from bringing the joy of role playing games to all, I also double in uh, running role-playing games uh, as a bookable GM uh, with a main focus on a Mage the Ascension uh, which is uh, also one of the games uh, based in the greater world of darkness and it is the only game that I would actually take money for, for running as it is a rather demanding game to run other than that I bring the joy for everyone for the price of fun uh, but yes, I would say that uh, this is all that we needed uh, for the round of introductions. And uh, let us uh, go now quickly uh, to a little tiny detail uh, that may be uh, causing some uh, questions uh, for everyone. As I have been informed that we have a slight uh, technical difficulties with our uh, video setup, but uh, it is unfortunately what it is. Uh, the technology can all very often be uh, hard 